Okay, my love. We are talking about September 2024. We're talking about the mid month of September. Yes, we're here. So let's talk about what's coming up next. The energies in this video. I'm going to be talking about the energy updates, the forecast, what's coming up, what can you expect, how can you manifest? Because we're talking about the eclipse coming up. Okay, the lunar eclipse happening on September um, 17-18 is huge for manifestation, receiving. So I'm going to be breaking it down. What are the upcoming energies? how has it shifted since the beginning of the month and how you can work with it to make this month your best month ever so if you're interested keep on watching Welcome back, my love. This is Tina Wong, and on this channel, we talk about spirituality, how to expand your consciousness so that you can live a true, aligned life. So, if you are into anything like that, make sure you stick around, hit the thumbs up, subscribe, and you know, be around because we have fun here. We are, we get really up close and personal. <laughs> so, if you like the vibe, be around. Okay, if you guys have been here for a while, hi, welcome back. I love you. Okay, let's talk about September mid month. First of all, I have to begin talking about the 99 portal. Okay, uh, I posted the 99 portal energy activation on YouTube, so you can watch part one and part two. What happened during the 99? Okay, September the 9th, it kicked up a whole new wave of abundance. So how we're looking at our world, how we're looking at finances, well, how we're looking at uh, uh, abundance, how we're looking at money, how we're looking at things that bring us joy and love in a whole new different way. The collective is going through a whole shedding, clearing, cleansing, healing process right now so that the new world, the new earth can be built by the ones who have the expanded consciousness, which is of love, light, peace, freedom, joy. Okay, if that's you, you're on the right channel, you're on the right path. I want to talk about the energy that we are heading um, into around the uh, the mid month of September. So the September mid month, what you're going to be experiencing is that a slight shift in now that you have the codes from the 99 portal that something is happening. That is the final push, right? September, the the energy is number nine, and number nine is the last wave. Okay, I talked about this during my 99 energy activation, the light language activations. So you can watch that. The internet was cutting out. The power went off. The power, guys, it went off. So I had to go to multiple locations about that. If you know, you know who was there, <laughs> right? Um, I do want to mention that. The upcoming eclipse on September 17th, which I'm going to talk about right now, I'm going to be doing in um, a free event for you. Okay, I'm going to be doing a free event. We're going to do an energy activation. We're going to really anchor in our energies for receiving. It's a big portal for receiving. It's a big portal for manifestation, but it's also a big portal to like keep calm, cool, and collected. You don't want to be doing too too much. You want to be actually indoors okay so if you're interested in me guiding you through all of that uh, link is going to be down below for the free ticket okay so grab your free ticket before it maxes out these things max out like crazy so get yours before it's gone i tell you okay so as we are moving towards the lunar eclipse this is what this energy of the mid month is preparing us for so around the 17th around the 19th or on the 17th rather of, of september you are going to be experiencing uh, some kind of unexpected, some kind of sudden shift. Okay, I talk more about it during um, my September five manifestation portal videos. So I'll link that one below. Watch that one so you know all the five major days in September. But what happens is that the lunar eclipse on the 17th is going to really kind of crack you open in breaking a certain pattern in your life and also. At the same time, receiving a major manifestation. So if you've been, you know, thinking about I'm ready for the new home, the new love, the new uh, outlook on finances, a new career, new way of being, etc., this lunar clip is going to be huge because it's going to reveal to you. And I'll make a separate video on the lunar clips maybe tomorrow. So uh, watch out for that video. The energy of you being aware and being clear um, about when you are ready to receive something, the universe 
kind of challenges you or tests you do you really want it are you really ready so for example if you're like you know what i'm so ready for the new love tina give me the new soulmate give me the six pack give me you know the curvy bot whatever it is you're into i don't know okay um you are going to be experiencing maybe your ex popping back okay you can be experiencing the, the the type of the bad boy the bad gals that you say you're not into anymore but they be coming up okay so the universe is like are you really ready for the one are you really ready for the only are you really ready for the good boy good girl good partner good relationship healthy relationship in your life or you're still chasing or you're still wanting and part of you is still opening to the past situation the ex situation the um you know the bad boy bad gal situations okay you say you want a good boy the good man then you have to let go of the bad boys okay so this is the situation guys you are being tested can be around up to, from now up to that that time to see are you ready so if you are ready what you'll be experiencing is that there can be a lot of people you know who are in those categories okay can be um coming out of your life can be um can be clearing out of your life because you're saying that no i am holding space for mr right mrs right i ain't got no time i ain't got no space for the exes for the whatever random boys and gals that i know that it's not good for me Okay, so that's for relationship. But if you're manifesting something like career or um, impact in life or um, uh, success, uh, wealth, stuff like that, you are going to be tested of how abundant are you really, really? Because you can only attract what you are, yeah, right? <laughs> so when you're like, okay, I'm ready to attract abundance, I'm ready to like open up my channel of receiving, you know what that means, right? It means that you need to open up your channel of giving also, right? Giving is receiving energy of abundance. So if you are like afraid to spend, you know, you feel bad when you spend something, right? And then when someone's trying to help you, uh, give you a gift, you're like, no, 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 no. I feel bad accepting it. No, 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 right? So basically you're saying and doing the opposite of what you like says to the universe. So this is really interesting because this is going to be a time where everything has to align. If you want a manifestation, it doesn't have to, okay? So this is when you are being um, challenged, being tested, being prepared to receive that manifestation. So that's why I said on the lunar eclipse, I will be doing a live energy activation um, event um, to really ground the energy to really receive in confidence and you know i always do my teachings there okay so that extra um, type of master class in there for you as well as my channel messages so if you're interested in that link is down below it is free get your butt on um into it it's gonna be very powerful i'm so excited <laughs> last lunar eclipse of the year guys come on let's go so i want to talk a little bit about the upcoming energy so when you are in this eclipse season e eclipse um of Pisces it's going to be the sign as and it's a very spiritual sign so you're going to be getting all sorts of creative um, searches a lot of intuitive hits about certain things certain people certain situations so what I want you to do is to trust that okay trust where you're being led trust what is coming towards you um, trust what is coming out of your life so the more you allowing it to be easy and flowy okay Pisces okay it's the sign of the moon so you're gonna be feeling this one. It's going to be quite um, flowy. So you're gonna be you're gonna be asked to trust. Okay, trust when things just shift out, people to shift out, and then people to shift in. Don't make it mean so much. Okay, just kind of go with the flow. Okay, that is just the the guidance here. Just flowing with the flow. Flow and it's okay. It's okay. I'm witnessing. I'm witnessing. That's exactly what you might want to be doing around this time to get the best result because it can be a, a quite um, intense energy time where you can feel into the chaos and be swept away with the tidal waves if you are not careful. That's why stay calm, stay indoors, stay chill, stay collected, come to the uh, lunar event, lunar eclipse event, and we are going to calm our energy, okay? And ground our energy, very important. Don't be doing crazy stuff outside, stay indoors. So after that, what, what's going to happen is that we're going to be heading towards the, um, a new season of um, Libra. So we're turning 
away from Virgo, the introverted hermit, okay, studious sign, focusing on healing. And you know, during Virgo season, you're gonna be experiencing a lot of healing, a lot of um, reflection. So that's why I put my heal bundle on sale for you guys until um, the 22nd, okay? So uh, link is gonna be down below if you want to spend five days in the healing oasis with me, join hundreds of people who are in there already and doing this kind of work together because it really does help when there are people doing it side by side with you. And I'm gonna be there um, guiding you through step by step what to do, what not to do, what to feel into, you know, how to breathe, how to, you know, go about things. So like, I'm gonna be literally there every single step, five days, okay? You get instant access you get in right away so when you have that so if you are ready to clear out all the gunk in your life if you're ready to just cry it out if you're ready to receive in a big way you must be able to release and let go in a big way so these five days huge okay huge and also huge promotion never done this before so link is down below get your butt on it you're probably gonna never gonna see it again at this price so this is just Virgo season gift for you for healing so click the link down below for the heal bundle so around the 22nd, you're going to feel that energy of healing moving into Libra, which is more um, hours, you know, social butterfly of the zodiac. What you're going to be experiencing is that, okay, now I am ready to make connections. I'm ready to mix and mingle. I'm ready to add new, fresh energies, opportunities into my life. So this is going to be a time for networking. It's a time for socializing. It's a time to go out out there get your ideas out there sharing your ideas out there so if you know that you've been um, doing the work on yourself doing the work in your business in your career in your life path and your whatever it is that you want to focus on Libra season is going to bring through a lot of um, rewards and the reason being is that Libra is the sign of the of the judge of the of the scale so basically you're gonna get rewarded for being a good boy, being a good girl, okay, basically. So if you know, if Virgo season, you were studious, you took the lessons, you did the healing, you did the clearing, you do the inner work, you gotta do the work in, 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 in Virgo season, is what I'm saying, like do the work. Do the work in Virgo season, be studious, get onto your healing, and then you are going to be receiving huge rewards in Libra, mark my words. Libra season is gonna bring through a lot of opportunities for many, many of you guys who are actually ready for it okay things you know energies are there but it might not happen for everyone why is because it happens to the capable ready open vessels okay open and clean okay clear vessels okay so you can be attracting new love into your life new friendship new partnership okay new opportunities new financial um, income streams new um, creative channel idea inspirations um, just really good things okay but you have to kind of feel into that lightness of energy so that's why we have to purge out any heavy energies during Virgo season okay so if you haven't got your heel bundle get it get it you are not gonna regret it I, I, I promise you it's beautiful five days the energy of you moving into this whole new equinox okay we're also moving to a, a autumn equinox in the northern hemisphere what you're going to be really experiencing is that things are going to start to uh, fall apart you know autumn fall things are going to be falling apart so you're going to be feeling the the effect of this lunar eclipse dragging on it's not just like okay the day of the full moon no, this is a lunar eclipse, okay? Full moon, full super moon, okay? So you are going to be really feeling the whole letting go, the purging, um, also the receiving, depending on where you're at, depending on the work that you do on yourself, you know, in the work, the healing, like I said, depending on that, you are going to be receiving in a big way or you're gonna be keep on clearing out in the big way. And for most of us, it's gonna be both, okay? It's gonna be you're simultaneously receiving and you're simultaneously <clears throat> clearing and saying no to the untrue things at the same time so that energy is going to be dragging on okay not dragging on in a bad way but it's going to be prolonged um i would say for the rest <clears throat> of september okay for the rest of september that's going to be the theme because when eclipse season and then when we are at the end of september what you're going to be experiencing is this new 
refresh energy but only at the end okay <laughs> only at the end you're gonna be feeling oh my gosh things are getting lighter because um october the 4th we are going to be having a um uh, a solar eclipse right so lunar that's about the moon solar um it's about the new moon okay the sun so it's gonna be a new cycle a new beginning a new um a new sudden change okay I'll, I'll talk more about that when the time comes but again similar similar energies eclipses is all about sudden it's like slash like eclipse in eclipse out so you're gonna be ready for that so that's why if you watch my september five portals by manifestation portals video on my channel i'll link it below you will see that um i i really mentioned that it's important for you to keep calm keep calm be grounded um, be stable okay don't be crazy because there's a lot of moving energies even when you feel like nothing is moving you're doing that inner work your, your mindset is shifting your inner world is shifting so there's a lot of movements going on so stay grounded don't do too much if you don't need to okay don't attend too many things if your energy feels overwhelmed but do go out okay during the end of the month when you feel called to go to certain things or you are being invited to certain things okay and if you feel like maybe i should give it a go okay if you're feeling like that usually manifestation will come in through a random invitation okay so entertain that but what i'm saying is that don't overwhelm yourself don't overwhelm your system okay dogs so uh link to the lunar eclipse event with me live okay you and i internet uh, not guaranteed because i'm in tulum mexico right now because you know go up and down but i would love to have you there link is down below get it for free i love you so much let me know what comes through for you like this video if you got anything subscribe to the channel so that i can you know see more of you and you can see more of me yay mutual okay and with that i love you so much and i'll see you on my next video